Climate change has caused hundreds of walruses to plunge to their deaths off high cliffs daily ma. Published 0003 BST, April 6, 2019 Updated 0035 BST, April 6, 2019 When you think of the effects is having on the Arctic and its wildlife, it's often polar bears that come to mind. But, a shocking new segment of S. Our Planet has highlighted the gruesome fate of walruses, forced increasingly onto shore as sea ice dwindles. The David Attenborough narrated series shows a shocking look at walruses, who have become confused by a combination of shrinking ice cover and their own poor eyesight, causing them to scale cliffs and often plummet to their deaths when they attempt to return to sea. Scroll down for video. A shocking new segment of Netflix's Our Planet has highlighted the gruesome fate of walruses, forced increasingly onto shore as sea ice dwindles. The walruses have, in the disturbing clip, walruses can be seen perched precariously on the edge of the rocky cliffs, unaware of just how high up they are. All they know, Attenborough says, is that they need to join the other walruses and find food. A walrus eyesight out of water is poor, Attenborough says. But they can sense the others down below. As they get hungry, in their desperation to do so, hundreds fall from heights they should never have scaled. Walruses are among the top arctic species, feeling the effects of climate change as they rely heavily on sea ice to rest between hunts. As the ice shrinks, more and more are coming onto shore, WWF explains. In addition to unfamiliar and dangerous terrain, on land, they're highly susceptible to disturbance from humans, aircraft, or predators such as polar bears, which can spoof them and cause crushing stampedes, according to WWF. These massive marine mammals also give birth on sea ice, and turn to the ice edges to mate. A. Sea ice also provides crucial shelter from storms and predators, according to a NOAA report. The David Attenborough narrated series shows a shocking look at walruses who have become confused by a combination of shrinking ice cover and their own poor eyesight, causing them to scale cliffs and often plummet to their deaths when they attempt to return to sea. In the disturbing clip, walruses can be seen perched precariously on the edge of the rocky cliffs, unaware of just how high up they are. They then fall below, while the loss of sea ice may not drive them to extinction, scientists say it will have devastating impacts on their population. It is certain that land-based sites alone will not support the same number of walruses that the mixed seasonal use of sea ice and land has permitted in the past, scientists wrote in a 2015. Additionally, documented declines in the northern Bering Sea among dominant clam populations that are critical prey for walruses, associated with reductions in sea ice declines, provide cause for concern. Such ecosystems, the amount of Arctic sea ice peaks around March as winter comes to a close. NASA recently announced that the maximum amount of sea ice this year was low, following three other record low measurements taken in 2015, 2016, and 2017. This can lead to a number of negative effects that impact climate, weather patterns, plant and animal life and indigenous human communities. The amount of sea ice in the Arctic is declining, and this has dangerous consequences, NASA says. Additionally, the disappearing ice can alter shipping routes and affect coastal erosion and ocean circulation. NASA researcher Claire Parkinson said the Arctic sea ice cover continues to be in a decreasing trend and this is connected to the ongoing warming of the Arctic. It's a two-way street, the warming means less ice is going to form and more ice is going to melt, but, also, because there's less ice, less of the sun's incident solar radiation is reflected off, and this contributes to the warming, eh? The comments below have not been moderated. By posting your comment you agree to our. Do you want to automatically post your mail online comments to your Facebook timeline? 
your comment will be posted to mail online as usual. Do you want to automatically post your mail online comments to your Facebook timeline? Your comment will be posted to mail online as usual. We will automatically post your comment and a link to the news story to your Facebook timeline at the same time it is posted on mail online. To do this, we, you can choose on each post whether you would like it to be posted to Facebook. Your details from, published by Associated Newspapers Limited. Part of the Daily Mail, the Mail on Sunday Metro Media Group.